Good evening and welcome back to another episode of the 32-bit rant and today we are looking at this the writing's going to back to front isn't it it's basically Sony Vegas movie studio and DVD creator so let's dive into this Okay, so I've got the box unwrapped, and, and if you look at the bottom, I actually see the system requirements for this, which I can definitely run it on my modern laptop. You can actually see here, right, it does video edit, and it's also got sound effects, which I assume is the second disc. Let's get into this. Oh no, I bent the box, great. Well done, right? You're doing brilliant. Undo that flap, undo that flap. And use that thingy to open that. And if you look in the box, oh, you'll see there is a disc. Then there is a null disc. And there is a booklet. Followed by another. Oh, I can't get it out now. Followed by another booklet. And this here is what constitutes that massive box. But to be honest, look, there's the two discs, there's the books. You only need half that. Oh well. But it's cool. Right, I don't know if this is working. We'll see if it is. Right, so first of all I'm going to put in the first disc once I get it out of the packet. And then put it into the drive. And it says on the thing it should auto play, but I'm not sure, so we'll find out. Computer. Right. And as the drive goes off its rocker, we'll hit that. It's a very small box optimised for this 1920x1080 resolution. Uh, install Vegas Movie Studio software and so on. Yes. And it's loading, I hope. Yes, it has. There we go. Next. I uh, pretend I've read those. And I'll put a shortcut in the desktop. Because I might need this. I might edit this video with it. I do not know yet, though. Find out. Okay, this is taking a while. The moment is going to do one of those things where it just speeds straight across. You know, for there, till it's there. Or even to the end, that would be even better. Uh, we'll just need to wait and see. believe that is that completed so if I press finish well done oh wait I still need to install that what is the noise well I don't know I dread to think actually I mean this thing did get a bit damp at one point um, and it wasn't working but it seems to have started working again so I just need to make sure that this installing works various clicks later and it starts to do things over. So what's the second disc for? Ah, right. So that's what that's for. Mm, okay, that's one way of doing it. Um, come on. Come on. Please, hurry up. Please. Please. Mm. 
What would... Anyway, we'll combine them. Oh, wait. Never mind. We might be here. Still. Come on. Come on. That's quick. Right, we're maybe getting somewhere now. So, let's just see. Is that that's going to go right to the end? That's fine. And we'll come up with a thing saying it's completed, which is even better. Right, well, that was easy. Uh, we just exit the CD now. What was that noise? It's really weird. Uh, I'll eject the disc. And we'll need to try the movie studio now, but I don't know what to try it with. I'll go and get some videos or something, and we'll, I'll report back. Right, so there we go. I'm in the video editing doodad. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to pretend I know how to work it, so I don't need to consult the manual. We'll go to the click on media. We'll go to my documents, and I don't want to go into. I want to go into videos. We'll go videos for editing, and I've went and got music video. Ah, hang on. Import media. Try back. Right. So back works. It says cut and fugue in D minor for those that are actually interested in all this. And if I put it into video. I assume this is how this works. Is that my music? Right, so if I play, how do I play this? This one? Comes up on the small screen down here. Oh, I think it's, I think we've kind of made sense of that now. So what if I want to just get a picture of this guy here? I want to get some frames of just him playing this. Can I like highlight these areas? Is there a split tool even? Right click. Cut. Nope. That was stupid. Open and trimmer. No. Okay. Right, so it works. I don't know how to work it because I'm a simpleton that uses Windows Media Player, but it does something, as you can see. Oh, it keeps doing that. I don't know why. I think it's my audio device, my laptop. So what else can we do? Can we put text over it? I can try. Um, insert text media. Hang on. Ah, uh, so if we do that now, what happens when we play us from the beginning? Does the text come up? Yes, it does. So, and it stays up for a select amount of time, right? Oh. So, I think I've kind of got to grab some others, but I'm not going to keep this, I'll do something else and probably post it later on. But that's just a kind of overview how to work this. So there we have it. I've messed about with this for quite a while now. And you know something it's not bad. And I think at that we'll round things up. So today You've witnessed me trying to operate, what was the name of it? Sony Vegas Movie Studio and DVD Kit. I really haven't had time to test out the DVD part of things, but I'm sure I'll do something with that at some point. Additionally, um, as I said, I'll probably make like, some rubbishy movie thing and post it during the week. Could be traumatising as hell, we don't know yet. <laughs> so, anyway... Thank you for watching and good night, good evening, whatever it is, wherever you are. Thank you.